Good evening and welcome to Divine Healing Tarot. <laughs> Where we really just don't give a fuck. Okay? Y'all want to see my don't give a fuck? I'll show you my I don't give a fuck because I just really don't give a fuck. Okay? All right, here we go. Mm -hmm. Yes. <laughs> welcome to my channel. Mm-hmm. about there. Yeah, we'll get her there. All right. <sighs> yes. I just really don't give a fuck. <laughs> All right. Yeah, I've been uh, trying to spruce up my channel a little bit, so we got to come up with some new shit, right? And what's better than I don't give a fuck? I don't give a fuck readings. I love the I don't give a fuck. Oh shit. <laughs> I don't give a fuck readings, okay? All right, it's a little hard for Pisces to tap into, but I'm gonna go for the gusto, okay? This is called a Pisces reading that really does not give a fuck, okay? All right, here we go. Let's do this shit. Oh, see, we already got paradise falling out. Mirror bitch. <laughs> motherfucking mirror bitch all right bitch this is your motherfucking card right here all right mirrors each other self-image relationships reflection our wands be careful your motherfucking wands you want to put that shit away all right put that shit away you're in paradise bitch this is where you live this is where you thrive this is where you find your joy you find your peace you find your separation from life, from California especially. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. But I came from California. But, you know, it's like you can find your separation from your home because you finally left your home. You finally left that shit. All right? So fucking live that shit up. That's all I got to say. Live that shit up. You're mirroring this shit. You're mirroring your divine counterpart. Oh, oh, look what's under that. And look what's inside. You got that side, bitch. <laughs> you got that side, bitch, fucking hanging. All right, so you want this engagement. You want this divine counterpart relationship with your divine feminine. But you got this mirror. You're mirroring them. And you're like, fuck, I can't fuck with toxic energy. And your, your fucking counterpart's like, fuck, I got this snake on my ass. <laughs> what the fuck am I going to do with this bitch? You know, it's like, fucking, she's a snake. I know she's a snake. And I want you. I'm mirroring you. But I'm just, it's not coming through. Because we can't talk. Oh, look what we got under that. Axe. Okay, yes. This is your ex. Your ex is fucking with that shit. Anyways, um, <laughs> I'm getting too excited. I love the I don't give a fuck readings. By the way, yes, I have had two shots. And yes, I am medicated. And I'm not getting surgery. I am a healer. I am a healer. I could do this shit on my own. I'm not promoting alcohol. I'm not promoting... Yes, I am promoting marijuana. But <laughs> I love marijuana. But I'm not promoting alcohol. But just moderation is key okay if i couldn't get on here and give you guys a proper reading then i wouldn't do so and i've been feeling good vibes good energy this whole time so you guys need to talk to somebody okay you guys need to talk to somebody you guys need to uh let it out you know like get your emotions out there don't be afraid to engage with people and and you know maybe you were hurt maybe you were hurt and there's a lot of addiction here too and there was a hard time trying to ascend. And I got Phoenix too. I'm, I'm going to take it. I'm going to take it. Phoenix. And it's like, you know what? I'm fucking sick and tired of wearing the mask. Yeah. For post-traumatic stress disorder, you bet your ass I go and get two shots. I get two shots of 99. And it's usually like um, butterscotch or something like that. But And I'm not promoting alcohol, but I'm not, I'm not promoting dealing with post-traumatic stress disorder and anxiety. Or anybody else's bullshit that's wearing a mask. I, I don't promote that. 
but I do promote tolerance. I do promote moderation, okay? Moderation is key. Just like microdosing mushrooms, if you take a mushroom and say the cap is the size of this ring, okay, and you take a mushroom and you take a little piece of that mushroom, I'm talking like maybe a little tiny piece, like an Ativan, okay? Not a Xanax, not like a bar or anything, just a little Ativan. You take a piece of that mushroom and you put it under your tongue and you let it soak into your bloodstream and just a tiny little piece of that mushroom will actually calm you down just like better. I want to say not just as good, but better than Xanax or Anavan. Better than Xanax or Anavan. And it's like, it's this big. It's tiny, you microdose. I want you guys to look up microdosing mushrooms for anxiety and PTSD. Microdosing, okay? Not taking the whole mushroom, not taking the cap and the stem or an eighth and getting all fucked up. I but trust me, I've been there. You have to take whatever medicine you promote, you have to take it to the extreme before you could give it to anybody else, okay? So with that being said, I have taken mushrooms to my extreme and I know the tolerance in order to sit there and tell the collective of how to microdose. I, I'm 200 pounds. So if I could take a tiny piece, the size of a, I, I don't know if my phone's picking this up, but it's like this big, okay? <laughs> it's just a little tiny square and you put that underneath your tongue, it's just as good as an Ativan or a Xanax that the doctor wants to give you. I don't like medicine from the doctor. I don't. I got addicted to on all, all of it. They tried giving me medicine for pain. I was like, you know what? I took the pain medicine, I got addicted to that, and then I had to kick that, and it was horrible. I felt like I was gonna die. And then I realized, if you're in pain, tell yourself you're not and walk. You have to tell yourself you are not in pain and then walk. It's that simple. Guys, I'm telling you, with the power of God, it is that simple. You tell yourself you can walk and you close your eyes and you imagine God right there beside you. And you imagine God speaking into your ear. Now walk, my child, and it will be so. It's that simple. I'm going to leave the reading there. Yes, I am a little intoxicated. Yes, the low pressure system is aggravating my ACLs. And I have been hiking as much as I could with help. Okay, I got... A very good nurse a home health care nurse and you know what it's about time that I got back what I always gave out and that's home health care always look after your grandparents always look after the elderly and the handicap because you know what if they were the, the, the shoe was on the other foot they would be there for you in a heartbeat so always look out for them. I love you guys so much. This is a collective reading. And <laughs> this is me a little buzzed. <laughs> I love marijuana. I love cannabis healing. I love spirituality. I love freedom of speech. And I love you. God bless you, collective. I'll be on later. Bye.